Our tale begins in the heart of Raccoon City, where chaos reigns and bioterrorism is at its peak. Amidst the pandemonium, a clandestine group emerges from the shadows, the Umbrella Security Service, or USS for short. This elite squad of operatives, handpicked by the Umbrella Corporation, has a singular chilling mission to retrieve the G-Virus from the city's bowels. This isn't any ordinary retrieval mission, though. They're after the work of one William Birkin, a brilliant scientist whose genius teeters on the brink of madness. Leading this daring venture is a man known only as Hunk, a figure cloaked in an aura of mystery and dread. A seasoned veteran in the Resident Evil universe, Hunk is no stranger to the unspeakable terrors that lie in wait. With Hunk at the helm, the USS ventures into the infected city, unaware of the horrors that await. As the USS infiltrates the city, another force enters the fray. Enter Echo-6, an elite special forces team commissioned by the US government. Unlike the USS, their mission isn't to retrieve the G-Virus, but to expose the dark secrets of the Umbrella Corporation. Echo-6 is charged with the task of unveiling the true perpetrators behind the outbreak, a mission that requires courage, resilience, and an unwavering commitment to truth. As they descend into the heart of Raccoon City, the team is met with a sight that defies comprehension. Streets that once bustled with life now teem with the undead. Every corner reeks of death and decay, every alleyway a potential death trap. They are far from home, in a city of nightmares, yet they press on, their resolve unshaken. But the undead are not the only threat they face, as the eerie silence of the city is punctuated by the groans of the infected, a new sound begins to echo through the deserted streets, a sound that sends shivers down their spines, the heavy mechanical footsteps of a creature unlike any they've encountered before. It's the Nemesis, Umbrella's deadly bioweapon, and it's on their trail. The Nemesis is a monstrosity, a testament to the depths to which Umbrella has sunk in its pursuit of power. Unyielding and relentless, it hunts Echo-6 through the city, its single-minded purpose to eliminate any threat to Umbrella. The team finds itself in a deadly game of cat and mouse, the stakes higher than they could ever have imagined. Despite the odds stacked against them, Echo-6 fights on. The truth is their weapon, their shield against the horrors that Umbrella has unleashed. Each confrontation, each narrow escape, only strengthens their resolve to bring Umbrella's secrets to light. With two factions now in play, the stage is set for an epic battle amidst the undead. The struggle for survival has begun, and as Echo-6 delves deeper into the heart of Raccoon City, they know that they must succeed. For the truth must be revealed, an umbrella must be exposed, no matter the cost. In the depths of a secret lab, a desperate scientist makes a fateful decision. William Birkin, the brilliant mind behind the G-Virus, finds himself cornered, his life's work at risk. In a last-ditch effort to protect his creation, he does the unthinkable. He injects himself with the very virus he has forged. The substance courses through his veins, rewriting his genetic code, reshaping his physical form. He is no longer the man he once was. He becomes something else, something monstrous. The transformation is horrifying, a spectacle of grotesque metamorphosis. His body morphs and contorts, his humanity stripped away, replaced by an entity born of desperation and fear. Birkin, now a grotesque creature, serves as a chilling reminder of the perils of unchecked ambition. The horror of his transformation sends shockwaves through the city, raising the stakes and thrusting Raccoon City further into chaos. As Birkin transforms, the stakes are raised and the city descends further into chaos. With the city in turmoil, a new threat emerges. Nemesis, a bioweapon of terrifying power, is set loose upon the already beleaguered Raccoon City. This relentless force of destruction birthed in the shadowy labs of Umbrella Corporation brings yet another layer of chaos to the unfolding nightmare. Both Echo-6 and the Umbrella Security Service find themselves in the crosshairs of this terrifying adversary. Each encounter with Nemesis is a desperate struggle, a test of their resolve, their tactics and their will to survive. This monstrous adversary is no mere zombie. It is a titan, a walking apocalypse, a grim testament to the horrifying depths of bioweaponry. In the face of such an enemy, the race for survival intensifies. Every corridor becomes a potential battleground, every shadow a lurking danger. 
The streets of Raccoon City become a deadly maze. The echoes of Nemesis's footsteps a chilling reminder of the threat that looms over them. With Nemesis on the loose, survival becomes even more challenging. As the battle rages on, secrets are uncovered and alliances are tested. The Umbrella Security Service, once a united front, is now riddled with internal strife. The team members who were once comrades find themselves at odds as the true nature of Umbrella's mission becomes apparent. The objective was never just about retrieving the G-Virus, but also about covering up the corporation's dark deeds. In the midst of this turmoil, a shadowy figure pulls the strings from behind the scenes. Ada Wong, a mysterious operative with her own agenda, manipulates events to her advantage. She's a puppet master, subtly influencing the actions of both the USS and Echo-6. Her involvement adds another layer of intrigue to the already tense situation, her motives as elusive as her presence. Meanwhile, Echo-6 is on a quest for truth. Their mission leads them to uncover damning evidence of Umbrella's involvement in the T-Virus outbreak. The horror that has engulfed Raccoon City, the monstrosities they've faced, it all leads back to Umbrella. The realization is a bitter pill to swallow, but it strengthens their resolve. They're not just fighting for their own survival anymore, but for the truth to be revealed. The city is a battlefield, a chessboard where every move could mean life or death. With each revelation, the stakes get higher. The USS, Echo-6, Ada Wong, they're all pawns in a game much larger than themselves. They're caught in a web of betrayal and deception with the fate of Raccoon City hanging in the balance. As the dust settles and the truth comes to light, the stage is set for a final showdown. The lines have been drawn and there's no turning back. The revelations have come at a high cost, but they also bring a chance for justice. With the truth exposed, the stage is set for a final showdown. In the heart of the city, two factions collide. The showdown in Raccoon City is a tense, high-stakes confrontation between Echo-6 and the Umbrella Security Service. The two groups, each with their own objectives and allegiances, face off in the Raccoon City Police Department. It's a battle where every decision counts. Every move could be the last. Meanwhile, the enigmatic Ada Wong is pulling strings from the shadows. Her true motives, shrouded in mystery, begin to unfold. Is she a friend or foe? The line between ally and adversary blurs in the chaos of Raccoon City. But one thing remains clear. The fate of Raccoon City hinges on this showdown. As the battle rages on, the survivors must confront not only their enemies, but also the harsh realities of their situation. The stakes couldn't be higher. With Raccoon City's fate hanging in the balance, every decision counts. With the dust settled, the survivors grapple with the aftermath of bioterrorism. Raccoon City, once a thriving metropolis, now lays in ruins. The vibrant streets, once filled with life, are now silent, save for the eerie echoes of the past. The once towering structures are now mere skeletal remains, standing as a grim monument to the horrors that unfolded here. The survivors, those who managed to escape the clutches of the T-Virus, now face a harsh reality. Their homes, their livelihoods, their loved ones, all lost to the rampage of the virus. They stare at the destruction, their hearts heavy with grief, their minds haunted by the memories of the horrors they endured. Yet amidst the sorrow, a glimmer of justice emerges. The exposure of Umbrella's secrets, their insidious role in the outbreak, has sent shockwaves around the world. The once untouchable corporation, hidden behind a facade of medical research, now stands exposed, their dark deeds laid bare for all to see. The world now knows the true face of Umbrella, the monster that lurked in the shadow of Raccoon City. But this revelation has come at a tremendous cost. The survivors, bearing the physical and emotional scars of their ordeal, must now contend with the aftermath. The echoes of their encounters with the grotesque creatures, the monstrous nemesis, the transformed Birkin, will forever lurk in their minds, a constant reminder of the nightmare they lived through. Yet they remain resilient, their spirits unbroken. They are the true survivors of Raccoon City, the living testament to the human spirit's indomitable will to endure, to overcome, to rise from the ashes. They face an uncertain future, their path filled with challenges, but they march on, carrying with them the hope of a new tomorrow, a world free from the horrors of bioterrorism. In the wake of the T-Virus, Raccoon City is forever changed, a haunting reminder of the horrors of bioterrorism,